What's up all you viewers out there? This is Son of a Boof here. Today I share you comedic story number one by yours truly coming up right now. So before I begin today's story, I have a question for all you viewers out there. How many of you during your childhood has been forced to play an instrument by your parents? Raise your hands. Mm, I see a lot of hands up. That's good, that's good. Well, just to let you know, you're not alone. Yours truly has been forced to play an instrument by his old man. And guess what instrument that was? I'll give you just a tiny hint. It's made out of wood, and it has strings. Have you figured it out yet? That's right. I was forced to play the violin. <laughs> the beautifully crafted, but excruciatingly frustrating instrument of doom. Now, don't get me wrong. I like the violin when it's played by someone who's skilled at it, but back then when I was a child, it was really an excruciating experience for me. You know, practicing 45 minutes every day. But before that, you have to get your bow out and it's rosin and then you have to rosin the bow. And then after that, you get out your violin and you have to put it on your chin like this, your chin. And then you play like this with the bow and, and you have to figure out which string to play in order to make it right. I had to practice 45 minutes every day standing up with this violin on my chin with the bow and figure out which strings it's which and which I had to hold up and all that crap. Oh, it was freaking excruciating. <laughs> Please do keep in mind, uh, this is back when I was a child and all. And, you know, as a child, all I just want to do is just watch cartoons and play video games. But, uh, enough about that. Uh, getting back to my violin experience here. I do recall one good memory. Um, it was during my time, it was during a class at uh, the settlement school. Uh, my teacher was uh, teaching me um, this thing called a slur. And, um, I remember back then as a kid, I used to make, um, Fun of that, uh, you know, I was like, slur, 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 slur. But to all you viewers out there, the true reason why playing the violin was such an excruciating experience for me as a child, it was during my time at this new settlement school. I believe it was also in Germantown, and I had a new teacher who was continuing uh, teaching me to play the violin. She was very impatient, and she was easy to temper, and I really despised this teacher very much. In short, she was a bitch! Ooh, she was definitely a teacher I really despise so freaking much please do keep in mind i was just a freaking child forget your rosin she gets mad you play one string off she gets mad and impatient it was freaking madness i really couldn't stand being with her in that damn room 
My God, spending every freaking minute with this teacher trying to do my freaking best to play as perfect as I can with the damn violin. It was like, it's like spending like an hour and nine floors to the depths of hell, man. <laughs> Insult to injury. There was one day when I was in that class. My teacher, that teacher, she couldn't put up with it anymore. So here's what she did. She directed me downstairs, even had the audacity to escort me outside to where my dad was waiting. Outside to come pick me up. And she was freaking pissed, man. She was freaking pissed. She was telling my dad that she couldn't put up with me anymore because I, because she was impatient to how she was, how I was playing the violin and I always forgot my rosin and everything. Oh my God. And then after she was finished, I was in a world of freaking hurt, man. World of freaking hurt. <laughs> and you want to know what happened after that? The bitch laughed. The door was closed. The windows were closed as well. And then there was an awkward silence. Then my dad got severely pissed, man. So severely pissed that he yelled at the top of his lungs. It was so scary, man. He sounded like freaking DMX, man. Freaking DMX. It was like a freaking exclusive DMX concert! And that song was in my mind! X gonna give it to ya! X gonna give it to ya! Dun 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 You don't believe me? Then watch this! What? You're gonna learn it, Fallon! Me a little message for the teacher who put me through all this. If you're watching this video, if you recall my fate, I have one little thing I want to tell you. As a thanks for our time together and practicing the violin together. I hope this video haunts you for the rest of your life for putting me through this painful, excruciating experience. Really hope it does. <laughs>